Hello, welcome back to my YouTube channel, Praveen Kumar Women's Safety. Today we'll see some of the DBT interview questions. Those who are preparing for interviews, must and should watch this video. Okay, let's we'll discuss in detail. So first question is that what, what is DBT model? Okay, so DBT models are nothing but it's a .sql file or .py file that contains select statement. So whenever we run any model, what happen? Based on the metalization property, either tables, views, incremental or ephemeral will be created. See one more time. So dbt models are dot SQL file that contains select statement. Select statements contains against the transformation logic. Okay, so whenever we run what happened, either tables, views, ephemeral or incremental, based on the metalization property, objects will be created in the database. It can be snowflake, it can be redshift or anything. So this is the important dbt model. The second question is that what, how to run a DBT model? I have created a model, the select statement. I want to run the DBT model. How can I run? So DBT run hyphen M and the model name. So remember this all commands are case sensitive. So DBT run hyphen M and the model name. So we are executing this model by using this command. So third question is that what, how to refer a model? I have created a model. I have run the model and I want to refer the model in different models or different places. How can I refer by using ref zinza function? So this is the by using a ref function, I can able to refer a model. This is nothing but a ref function. This is ref zinza function. We need to pass the model name. It's like a normal table only. So by using a ref function, I can able to refer a model. Okay, this is the next question is that what? how to find which database and which schema connected. Okay, see whenever I run any model, we should be make sure like where our objects are getting created. So select current database, current schema. Okay, so first we'll discuss in the theory, next we'll discuss the ex explanation also. I'll try to explain in detail one second. Okay, first we'll see this PPT. Once we complete the PPT, I'll try to explain with the dbt cloud ui so question is that what so by using select current database current schema we want to know where our models are getting created so by using current database current schema so next question is that what create a transient table so remember one important thing so if you're working for dbt you should know how to create a transient table permanent table so how can we create so here by using what by using config so just to by using config, metal is equal to table. So transient table will be created. So this one we use regularly. So transient table, permanent table, normal view, secret. So by using config macro, we are able to create transient table. So metal is equal to table. It will be created as a transient table. So next question is that what? what's the next question? So see. I want to create a, it's not a transient table, it's a permanent table. Okay, how to create a permanent table? One second, let me edit it. Okay, next question is that permanent table, how to create? So same thing by using config macro. This is called as a macro. Metro is equal to table. If I put, it will create as a transient table. Now I want to make it to permanent table. How to make it, which mention transient equal to false. When you put transient equal to false, what happened? Permanent table will be created. When I remove this functionality, what happened? By default, transient table will be created. So as a part of DBT developer, you should know the difference between transient table, permanent table, temporary table. These are very important. Okay, so answer is that by using config macro, I can create a okay, permanent table and a transient table. Similarly, one more question is that what? Create a normal view from DBT. So how can I create this also by using config? Config metal is equal to view if i put what happened normal view will be created okay so see config macro metal is equal to view if i put view normal view will be created so next question is that what how to create a secure view from dbt same thing this also by using config macro config metal is equal to view so extra thing what i should mention Secure equal to true. If I put secure equal to true, what happened? Secure view will be created. Metal is equal to view, secure equal to true. Now what happened? Secure will be created. So next question is that what? What is query tag? Okay, so those are working. This will be used regularly in day-to-day -day project. 
So query track is nothing but what I want to track my SQL queries executed from DBT. There are so many queries are executed. I want to track all the queries. How can I track by using query tag? So by using query tag, I can able to track all the SQL queries executed from a DBT. Okay, this is also important. So next question is that what various way to execute a DBT model. There are so many ways we can able to execute it. One is DBT run hyphen M and the model name. So same similar fashion, DBT run hyphen hyphen model and the model name. Hyphen M hyphen hyphen model, same thing, hyphen S and the model name, hyphen hyphen select a DBT model. Hyphen M hyphen hyphen model, hyphen S, hyphen S. So anyways, we can able to all have the same functionality, okay? Okay, got it. So next question is that what? Okay, I got the separate answer. Okay, and one more update is that what? Okay, from May 2nd, okay, so new DBT batch is going to start. Okay, so if you want, you can able to reach out. If you like the content, subscribe and share the channel. Thank you for watching.